Romans chapter 8. Verse 8. <clears throat> so then they that are in the flesh cannot please God. Paul is talking about life and the Spirit. Jesus calls it in John 3 being born again. And then after Jesus mentions the new birth, he transitions right into worship in the next chapter in John 4 with the woman of Samaria. verse 23 of John 4 but the hour cometh and now is when the true worshipers shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth for the Father seeketh such to worship him God is a spirit and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth Psalm 38, a psalm of David, to bring to remembrance. O Lord, rebuke me not in thy wrath, neither chasten me in thy hot displeasure. For thine arrows stick fast in me, and thy hand presseth me sore. There is no soundness in my flesh because of thine anger, Neither is there any rest in my bones because of my sin. For mine iniquities are gone over my head, over mine head. As a heavy burden, they are too heavy for me. My wounds stink and are corrupt because of my foolishness. I am troubled. I am bowed down greatly. I go mourning all the day long. For my loins are filled with a loathsome disease, and there is no soundness in my flesh. I am feeble and sore broken. I have roared by reason of the disquietness of my heart. Lord, all my desire is before thee, and my groaning is not hid from thee. My heart panteth, my strength faileth me. As for the light of mine eyes, it is also gone from me. My lovers and my friends stood aloof from my sore, and my kinsmen stand afar off. They also seek after my life, lay snares for me, and they seek my hurt, speak mischievous things, and imagine deceits all the day long. But I, as a deaf man, heard not. And I was as a dumb man that openeth not his mouth. Thus I was as a man that heareth not, and in whose mouth are no reproofs. For in thee, O Lord, do I hope. Thou wilt hear, O Lord my God. For I said, Hear me lest otherwise they should rejoice over me. When, they, when my foot slippeth, they magnify themselves against me, for I am ready to halt, and my sorrow is continually before me. For I will declare mine iniquity, I will be sorry for my sin, but mine enemies are lively, and they are strong. And they that hate me wrongfully are multiplied. They also that render, render evil for good are mine adversaries, because I follow the thing that is good. I said that wrong. I'll read verse 20 again. 
They also that render evil for me. I said that wrong again. Verse 20. They also that render evil for good are mine adversaries, because I follow the thing that good is. Forsake me not, O Lord, O my God. Be not far from me. Make haste to help me, O Lord, my salvation. 